we're here uh, setting up this skateboard. We're gonna start with a quick grip job. I'm gonna show you guys um, just a different way of uh, setting it up. Um, a lot of people set their board up fully gripped, where it's gripped from the tail to the nose. We're going to do something similar, but except I'd like to expose some of this top graphic here from this font here to this font here. And to get that crisp, clean line without having to cut this sheet or measure or with ruler or any of that, I'm going to show you a quick um, trick on how to show that usual top graphic. So what we're going to do is just use this straight line here and butt that right up against the font there. With the remaining piece, we're going to take this piece here and do the same thing to get that crisp straight line down here as well. First thing we got to do is go ahead and peel this back. And it's not too bad, just like peeling a sticker. When peeling it, make sure that it is coming clean, the paper, off of your grip. And you want to get it right the first time because we're working with a sticky surface here. So if you're doing it over and over, you're going to lose that stickiness. I'm only going to peel back a little bit so I don't have too much that I have to fight with as far as um, this sticky, tacky paper. And line this up, giving myself about a quarter of an inch on either side here. And go ahead and just tap that down on the edge. See how it looks before I push down to make a commitment. Once you're happy with your straight line, go ahead and peel the rest back. And with your hand, just go ahead and push down on the grip. And you gotta keep in mind that the board with the concave, um, you're gonna curve your hand as well. I'm going to cut off the excess with a razor blade. Right up to the edge here. Cut away from you at all times. And now with the remaining piece, I'm going to use that straight edge again that the uh, factory from the grip company has cut for us. There we go. Hold on to this. I'm going to show you guys a helpful hint with the paper that it comes with. We're going to line up this last piece here. A little easier with the smaller piece and also the second time around. Tap it here. Looks good. I'm going to push down on the rest. And now I'm going to show you what I meant by this coming in hand. Um, you want to get rid of all your air bubbles. And the best way to do it without hurting your hands on the grip tape is take this backing and put it down and go ahead and you'll start hearing the popping noise. Just go ahead with the, your fist, the bottom of your fist and push down. Make sure that you get all the bubbles and all the air out of the grip. Thank you. 